YouTube, yo, what's happening, lads? It's your boy, Solar Sky, back again for another video. And yes, today I actually come with some good, good news, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, lads, so today I have exciting news, and this has to do with NVIDIA GeForce now coming to South Africa. Without yapping further or talking a lot, let's just hop onto the laptop and then I can show you what I'm talking about. Okay, lads. So as you can see, I am on the website www.nag.co.za. This is like a news update of NVIDIA GeForce Now in South Africa. Exciting news as you can read here by the topic itself. Reigns NVIDIA GeForce Now expected to launch towards the end of June. We are in May. Today is May the 14th. I actually just had a look at it. It is Mother's Day. Hopefully I can release this video today as well. But anyway, let's read this whole article over here. The NVIDIA GeForce Now hardware has landed in the country and an internal beta is already underway, meaning that people are already playing with um, NVIDIA GeForce Now in South Africa as it is already launched. It is an internal beta. So even if you did sign up for the beta, that would be like a closed beta. This is an internal beta, meaning employees of Rain and NVIDIA GeForce now only. They are testing it for now. We can confirm that the server equipment is now in country and we are working closely with NVIDIA to deliver the best possible gaming experience for our users. The team is hard at work on the beta trials to ensure a smooth, efficient launch. Okay, so they just confirmed what I was saying, meaning that they are working on it internally but let's continue reading late last year rain announced that it had signed a partnership agreement with nvidia to bring geforce now cloud gaming to south africa with geforce now servers hosted locally in rain data centers now i don't know still to this day if you would need a rain subscription if you need to be on rain 5g or any subscription of rain i'm not too sure if you need a subscription to rain itself in order to access nvidia geforce now i'm probably sure that would be the thing because they are bringing it here so in order for them to make their profits they probably will have a package probably 5g with nvidia geforce now oh yes for only this amount per month but anyway let's continue reading the geforce now cloud gaming service is nvidia's attempt at capturing an audience of gamers looking to game from devices that cannot play games natively such as older notebooks low-end pcs computers and even mobile apparently yeah it is on mobile sorry i even launched a few tutorials <laughs> But yes, boys, so basically on your old laptop and stuff like that, you'll be able to play your games like Fortnite and GTA and basically all those games on your old laptop that can't run it directly. By streaming a game directly from a GeForce Now hosted server virtually, any device can stream that can stream Netflix should be able to run any game. Of course, latency plays a critical role so the service will be best enjoyed over a fiber connection or a 5G wireless service. Subscribers to the service will be able to stream games that they already own. So if you own PC games already like Fortnite or Valorant or any other PC games that you already own, right? From platforms like Steam, Epic, Ubisoft and Origin. Basically, you know when Epic Games gives you free games for a month or something like that. I don't know how it works on PC. Like I know I have NBA 2K22 or 21. It's a free game that was free on Epic and they gave it to us. Which means that when I do get NVIDIA GeForce now, I'll be able to play my NBA 2K22 because my laptop can't play it, but I'll be able to play it on my laptop via GeForce now. Epic, Ubisoft and Origin. Now here's the exciting part. Rain also confirmed that the service is set to launch towards the end of June later in our second quarter. So boys, I actually read this part here. Origin. Origin is EA. So in my mind, I want to play FIFA or EA FC 24. Not on old gen anymore, but I want to play it on new gen. Next gen. I want to update. I want to be next level. And then I went to go look at the list of Origin games and I went all the way. This is all the games that supported an Origin, meaning you'll be able to play it on 
NVIDIA GeForce Now. So there's, you can just look up the list of origin games and you'll be able to play it on GeForce Now. And obviously me, I went to F Formula One 2022, Formula One 2023. I'm already happy. That's all I wanted was Formula One. But then I went further down to F and ladies and gentlemen, there we have it. There you go. FIFA 2021, 22 and 23 is available on Origin, meaning that I will be able to play it alongside these other games. Should I own it? Of course, I need to own it first. I can't play it for free, but I'll be able to play it from my unsupported laptop. And now if I look here, okay, I don't see it yet, but I was looking for EAFC. But anyway, that's going to close it for today's video, boys. Are you excited for NVIDIA GeForce now? If you are, keep it right here on the channel. Make sure to subscribe to the channel if you want more NVIDIA GeForce Now news in South Africa as well as gameplay when it does come out, testing and optimizations when it does come out. And for then, for now, basically, I'll see you then next time on Soul TV, boys. Let's go.